to my Morning Report analysis videos from me, which Pair Market Analyst at Antic Markets on Wednesday, 12th of July. Looking at Euro dollar, we're still in this uptrend, um, and it's broken higher from the resistance 14.45 that uh, had been holding um, a couple of weeks ago. Broke high yesterday on the back of that weaker, weaker dollar. And um, it seems to be going ever closer towards 15 big figure, which is sort of 11 big figure to 13 big figure, that range that we had back from late May, uh, May into June. Um, projected higher is 15 big figure. Uh, today's high 14.89, so not a million miles off that, but uh, you look at the momentum indicators, all strongly configured. Buying to weakness continues, you've got that uptrend, rising moving average, m moving averages. It all looks pretty strong, doesn't it? So any sort of um, unwinding move is a chance to buy. You've had a bit of an unwinding move today, back to that breakout level around sort of 1440, 1445 uh, as the basis of support. Is that a buying opportunity? I'd say buying opportunities between 1390, 1380, sorry, 1380 and 1480, uh, 1445. I think that, that would be your buying opportunity level. Um, that would give the RSI a chance to unwind. 40 seems to be pretty consistent. MACD lines and stochastics are still tracking lower, so maybe there is a, still a little bit of room to unwind into. Um, but yeah, a sort of basis of support around that sort of 14 big figure area, I think would probably be ideal. That would also be sort of middle um, of the recent sort of arguably trading area. And uh, yeah, I think it would be uh, a pretty decent buying opportunity level. Um, so yeah, still pretty strong in Euro dollar. You've got that Yellen congressional testimony today. It'd be interesting to see how hawkish she comes out. Um, but certainly the Euro pretty much remains in the driving seat of this pair as the Euro bulls continue to pull higher. So I wish you good luck in your trading and I'll speak to you later. Thank you.